pieces all are gathered Things quietly waiting to mend In every corner that pain demands Until it's timely end If all goes well You can sing it all goes well if all goes well, if all goes well, we will find the strength to make them whole again. If all goes well, sorry state of an angry heart poisons the landscape of desire. And it slams the door on every cry To turn and face the fire If all goes well If all goes well We will open up and reach once more If all And whisper blessings each time we cross Mend what we can and with the rest Accept inevitable loss If all goes well, all goes well If all goes well Welcome to Wednesday Evening Musicale. This episode is called A Day Late and A Dollar Short uh, because it happens to be one day after my father Gus's birthday, which uh, was, of course, yesterday. And uh, among all of you tonight, he is front and center, the celebrity, the guest of honor. And so that was one of his requests. And in fact, just to get us all in the mood, Let's sing. Okay, everybody now. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Gus. Gus. birthday dad <laughs> could you hear them all singing I could well speaking of happy uh, this next song I want to do isn't one that you requested dad but I have to say and I don't even know if I ever told you this but uh, many many years ago I, I had this little book one of my many little writing books that I'd been jotting things down in for the better part of a year sometimes things I thought of and sometimes things I eavesdropped and um, and I sat down one day and I started leafing through the book 
and lifting one line and then another and then another and realized that I had been kind of serially writing a song without realizing it over the course of a year. And one of your quotes, one of your famous quotes, Dad, ended up in this song that I stole from you one morning when we were together on Beaver Island and you, and you got up and you said, it was a kind of a gray, rainy day, and you said, well, let's snap up the shade and let in the gloom. So it landed in this song. People can't love from a long, long distance. Some can't love from across the room. Some jump up in the morning to glimpse the sunrise. Some snap up the shade and let in the gloom. But it's a big enough world and it takes all kinds. The good, the bad, mostly the in between. I love the people with a happy heart. Or oh, let your heart dance. your knees and your call but old time and gravity can keep you way down if you let yourself get out of fly I need the people with the happy hearts let your heart fly yeah just take it all in to see where you fit let it all out Shame in the silence when you need it most of all to be heard. You've had some love and it's sweet as a lemon taking slow poison from the slippery word. No one has ever made the last mistake yet. celebrating my dad's birthday, but we're also um, celebrating um, a, a little buzz that happened recently on Facebook. Um, I'm not sure who posted it, but um, it was that a group called Jefferson Starship, which had originally been Jefferson Airplane back in the day, had recorded a song of mine called Blessing. And the reason I found this out First, let me say it's not new news, it's old news. This would have been in about the, uh, well, around 2000, I guess. Um, there was an all music guide. It was one of the early online bio things. And it came to our attention that <clears throat> I had written a song called Blessing, which I, of course I knew already, but that it had been recorded by Jefferson Starship. And I went, well, no, I, I would have heard about it, surely. And so toddled on down to the record store and Teresa at Good News Music in Traverse City, Michigan, looked it up and said, well, yeah, as a matter of fact, uh, oh, it was on a, supposedly on a, a recording called Windows of Heaven. She said, well, they did put out a CD called Windows of Heaven, and we have it here. So we went and we got it out, and I looked on it, and the song wasn't on there. And I went, you see, the Internet 
isn't always right. I, I even knew this back then, before I was even on it. <laughs> but she said, well, no, wait a minute. It says here that they also put out a release in Germany. So she looked it up, and sure enough, um, that song was on it. So we ordered a copy from Germany. It uh, came in the mail. It says, uh, Ich soll nicht mehr. And it was 16, comma, 99, which would have been, of course, Deutschmarks. And there on the back is my song, misspelled blessings. It's actually called blessing. And, um, and so Jefferson Starship, not airplane, um, new personnel, Diana Mangano is the new singer on it. And they did a really uh, bang up version of it, much like my friend Sally Rogers and I did it in, on our 1987 album, Closing the Distance, only with a lot of rock and roll and drums, rock and roll guitars and drums, but same harmonies. Um, so of course, I'm thinking, wow, maybe this is going to buy me a house or something. And I, and I sicked Harry Fox, Harry Fox on him, and a few months went by. And it turns out that at that point in time, Jefferson Starship wasn't exactly at the zenith of their performing career. So a few months after that, I received in Deutschmarks a check for what, uh, what came to about $250. But it's better than nothing, right? And I, you know, I had this, I had the, the cred of having a song by Jefferson Starship on an album. And I had this wonderful sort of cartoon image in my head of Jefferson Starship, you know, gathered around a record player, or a, a CD player, um, listening to Sally and I singing this song, Blessing Him, going, wow, those chicks rock. <laughs> so here it is in its um, original form. I just wanted to mention the Deutschmarsch because, um, hang on a sec. Because I, like I say, that was two hundred and fifty dollars back in the uh, in the early aughts. So I still have my donation station up at my website, just in case you should care to want to visit it. Go to claudiaschmidt.com and uh, and and be happy for me. Now you can pretend you're Jefferson Starship or Sally or anybody else, and at the end of each. Line in the first verse, you sing with me, bless us both, set us both free. In the second verse, bless you both, set you both free. In the last verse, bless us all, set us all free. I am a dreamer and I am a doer, bless us both, set us both free. And I am a maker and I am a user, bless us both, set us both free. And I am a lover, and I am a hater, bless us both, set us both free. And I am among you, yet I am alone, bless us both, set us both free. Well, you are a singer. And you are a listener, bless you both, set you both free. And you are a baker, and you are an eater, bless you both, set you both free. And you are a worker, and you are a player, bless you both, set you both free. And you are a blind one, yet you are a seer, bless you both, set you both free. We're all coming and we're all going Bless us all, set us all free And we're all smiling and we're all crying Bless us all, set us all free And we are remaining, yet we're all changing and bless us all, set us all free And we are all living and we are all dying Bless us all, set us all free
couple of minutes if you can. Round up a glass of something and have it ready. Old devil pain You've often pinned me down Thought I'd cry And I'd beg you for the end And at that very time I was on my way back Friday from Michigan to Connecticut on my way to the airport and uh, I had a I had an episode that um, I had to write down and uh, so it's hot off the presses I share it with you tonight it's called I chat with God at the sit-go I stopped to top off my rental a couple miles from Gerald Ford International. I always pay at the pump, especially during COVID, but today my card is rejected twice. And the machine instructs me 
to see the cashier. I'm not in a big rush, so I mask up and go inside where I encounter a young African-American man beaming at me from behind his mask. He greets me, blessings. I tell him I was instructed to see him, and I hand him my card. So, he effuses, how has your day been? Well, pretty good, I answer. And suddenly I am explaining I have just visited my dad, who is dying of lung cancer. But he seemed good, so this might not be the last visit, but the first of some more visits. You see, he exclaims, I was just telling this friend that when you step out the door, you make your own reality. You know, if you're expecting a downpour, then you might go outside and get drenched. See, you just brought truth to those words. I nod and say, amen, and take my receipt. Blessings, he says as I walk out the door. Blessings on you and your father. I go back to my car, cry a little bit. I almost go back inside to tell him that my father is a lot of the reason I see life this way. But I really have to get going now. So I thank the machine, give it a pat as I top off and head down the road unexpectedly blessed and grateful. No storm nor fire can ever beat us down. No wind that blows but carries us Are you ready? Raise your glasses. Gus, happy birthday. We love you. And in some of your favorite words, too soon old, too late smart. <laughs> Thank you and good night.
further 